How does he do it? How does deaf contestant Niall DeMarco dance without being able to hear the music? There's lots of little tricks that we do and lots of little hand signals and uh, squeezes. Niall and his partner, Peter Murgatroyd, are now revealing some of their secrets. In the tango this week, I've got a lot of um, squeezing of when he has to move. And see that back scratch? That's a signal too. I give him a good scratch on the back if he's too slow. What's it like to dance without hearing music? Niall demonstrated the challenge. I've never seen anything like that that touched me so profoundly. Incredibly, Niall says the first time he ever danced was on the show. He spoke yeah, through his interpreter. In the beginning, I was definitely scared, you know. I didn't want to be off time and mess up the dance. That way a lot of people would look and just assume deaf people can't dance. Niall is one of 25 people in his family who's deaf. He says he has a gene passed through the family that causes hearing loss. I'm very happy the way I am. If you thought dancing deaf wasn't hard enough, just wait till you hear what's planned for their next dance. We're actually going to be blindfolding Niall in the performance as well, so taking away another one of his senses. We'll see how that works out.